Hello, uh, and tonight I just thought I'd try out my new phone because I finally gave in to the corporate machine and got an iPhone 5. I'm sorry. Um, it was a really nice episode of Doctor Who, uh, which is what they're just reviewing in case it wasn't clear from the title. Um, starting off, you know, I think um, Neil Cross, I don't know much about him, but of a different writer. We like that. Um, it, I don't know, I just... Clara ha taking a moment to go away and, and walk with, go away with that girl and talk to her. The Queen of Years, the little girl. Mary, great name. Um, that was really nice. That was the sort of thing that I haven't seen in Doctor Who for ages. Because Clara, all the way through the episode, was, was sort of turning around to people that she was meeting and going, what are you? Who are you? Why, why are you? What, 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 what is this? How do you feel? How do you feel? Something that we haven't seen for a long time because we just had Amy. Amy. Amy and Rory in the TARDIS where basically it's just this big circle of Rory going, Oh, Amy, I love you. And Amy's like, Oh, no, I love you. And, you know, very boring. And, 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 and there was a lot of us felt that, you know, with Amy it was really annoying because she never took an interest in anyone. She was so selfish. The great, one of the great things about Donna was that, uh, as a companion, was Donna always looked at people and was kind of like, you know, oh, what's your story? Are you okay? Are you okay? You know, she was so kind of harsh and brazen, but at the same time, she was always kind of like going, oh, that person's sad. I better go and talk to them. Whereas Amy was just like, oh, look, there's a sad person over there. Why, doctor? Hmm, I want to go home. Ah, ah, I want stuff. I want Rory. I want this. I want that. Like, mm. so it's nice. I like Car I like Clara. I like where she's going. I liked. Having a bit of backstory, having parents with faces, parents with faces. Imagine such a thing. I just felt so weird that with Amy, you know, you didn't find out who her family were till, till like you know, like that weird episode in the finale of series one. We don't even meet them. They're just two a Scottish couple, and then they don't have any real proper character, and you, and you never actually get to like know them or anything. They don't mean anything at all. I mean, at least when you meet Rory's dad, he kind of means something because you get to know a wee bit of, you know, he's got a character, you see a little bit of his relationship with Rory and, I mean, like, it's really weird that, you know, they made that kind of thing, oh God, you know, I'm not going to see my dad again, but, you know, they never seem to make a notice of, you know, Amy's family. Anyway, I'm getting a bit kind of sidetracked here, but it's nice that Clara has a family and a, and a background. And, and mean something, you know, like like they are, like the Russell T Davis companions did. Um, this is going on for too long now because it's nearly three minutes. I really liked that episode. It was really um, fun. It was good fun. I, 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 fun's the wrong word. Well, fun isn't the right word. Is isn't the wrong word. Um, the like the the scenes at the beginning of you know Clara kind of going out the sort of tar is the first time and going, oh ha ha. Look at all the things and the people and the, and, the, and the stuff, you know, and and being back in that ride of. I mean, it felt like a first episode. It felt like a first episode where, you know, we're we're, go, we're going out again and we're seeing the world and we're going to the you know, and Doctor's like, oh, what do you want to go? What do you want to do? And she's like, ah, I don't know. And, uh, you know, it just and that, that really good thing where she's like, you know, you know, somebody asked you what your favorite book is, and you're like, I don't know, because you've immediately forgotten every book you've ever read ever. So. You know, when Doctor's like, ah, it's the same. And I, I, I like that, I like that. So the whole thing was really fun. I, I wasn't... I mean, a friend of mine, um, Alan uh, McQuan, uh, on on, on uh, Facebook was known after the episode that he felt um, the mu musical thing maybe wasn't... Oh, that's spectacular! But that it was the first positive reaction he's had to an episode um, recently. So that was good. Uh, I, I I kind of agree. I, I wasn't so sure about all the music stuff. Mind you, I thought like the girl singing was kind of nice, and it was like, oh, it's nice, isn't it? Um, anyway, that's four minutes thirty four. Nobody wants to watch all this, so um, I'm going to make a leaving. I really enjoyed that episode, and I'm going to give it. Okay, forget about my five out of five last week. I don't like giving things ratings. No, I'm not going to give a ring. No rings. I liked it. And that's it. I just liked it. It was a fun episode of Doctor Who. I liked it. It was fun.
Goodbye.